We just won this 5x5 abandoned storage unit for $90. Check this guy out. Look at these boxes. One, two, three, four, five, six mystery boxes and the TV box of the mystery box too to me. Let's see what we got. The reason we bid on this one really is because there's another unit right down there that I really wanted that we also want and this one was right in the same place and it was less than a hundred bucks. So why not, right? Right. Where do we start? Let's pick a box. Okay, I'll start here. Why not? It's the first box. I see water bottles and I see COVID-19 tests. Nice. Exactly what I needed <laughs> in my life. Oh! Look what Ooh, else I see. Holsters. That's a nice little holster. Is that two? What is that? That oh, is another holster. It looks like more is of it? a concealed one. No, it's a light. It's a light thing. Oh. The lighthouse. Mm. But okay. I wasn't expecting that in here. The only reason, the only thing I even saw in here was that Nike box. You could see it through that box down there. That was the only thing I had to go off and figure. Maybe there were boxes of shoes, but oh, doesn't look like it. Hey. Here's a box of 50 rounds, nine millimeter. Are these hollow points? Yes. Let's go. What did you say? Yep. Where? Jacket and hollow point. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> you could open it to see if it was full. It's definitely full. You can tell by the weight. Look okay. at all this. I was not expecting this. Oh, these are loaded nine nice. bags. Look at that. These are hollow points too. Nice. Are they both full? They feel like they're both full. Oh yeah. Nice. Oh yeah. 90 bucks. Shoot. We already got that. That's how you start out a unit right here. Another holster. What is this one here? That's right really light. Right off the bat delivering. I know. Kidding. Okay. Let's see. Sweatpants. Ooh, what's this? Ooh. Ooh. Hmm. What is that? I don't know. Mystery oh, look. Oh, says caliber nine millimeter on it. Oh, oh, it's a little cleaning kit. It's yeah, nice. We got a lot of nines. Oh yeah, just keep your gun stuff with your dirty boxers. That's fair. Mm -hmm. I hope that was a bleach stain. I really did too. Somebody <laughs> tell me it's probably not. Ooh, oh, PS5. A PS5 manual. Okay. Let's move some more clothes out the way. <laughs> then there's seasoning. Okay, so let me get this straight. You so need your onion powder with your boxers. There's some little army pins, but somebody somewhere was like, all right, time to pack up. Let's store my seasoning, my boxers, and my nine millimeter magazines in one box. Cause those things definitely go together. Smart guy. Well, since that box was so nice, I might as well go to the one that I saw from the pictures, the Nike box right there. Let's see what's in this guy. Nike. Oh, ew, it looks dirty. It looks like yeah. bug. Uh, well, I see light bulbs. I see dirty shoes. What is that? Uh, is that more ammo? What is this? Oh no, they're batteries. Hey. You need 40 triple A's? Might. Here we go. And I see this phone box too. What is this, a Galaxy A32? These aren't expensive, but it might be in there. Let's see. Samsung. No, just the, ew, what is that? That's just a curly <laughs> hair. We're just gonna hope it came from somebody's beard. There's a lighter smoking set. It's not in there. So what the heck is this up with this? Oh, look, I do see Emma though. Aha. Uh -huh. uh -huh. That's full. 40 S and W box. Nice and full. That's what I like to see. Let's see. What else is down here? A gaming LED strip. Hey, can we get one of those cool YouTuber computers? What about this? This is just a water bottle. There's a pocket knife. Oh, look. Look what I see. Nothing in there, dang it. But I just found two knives hooked together. That's kind of <laughs> random. Anything else in here? A blow off duster. No, not really, but hey, we're already finding weapons right off the bat. I have to say, I would not have even considered bidding on this unit if I didn't want that one next door, but this is why you bid on the random little ones, right? You just never know. Yeah. Let's go into this guy here and see what's in this box. Okay, it looks very random and fun. Is that Godzilla? Ugh, just closed. Okay, we got a Godzilla toy, I think. <laughs> Might not even be him, I'm not sure. What's in here? Something dropped up. This looks like a... LED of some sort. Yeah. Okay. Some kind of light. That's cool. Let's see. Oh, these drawer boxes? No way right now. Lighter. Oh, look at that. Hmm. It's a cool little lighter. What about this box here? This one's also. Oh, look at that. A USB, USB lighter. lighter. Okay. Hey, pull that uh purple bag. This? Out. Yeah. You hear that? Oh. Yes, I do now. What is that? Hey, let me get one out. These are. Island margarita. What are these? These are just fragrances. Fragrances? Okay. Yeah. Look, I thought it was like going to be like vape juice or something like that. Well, I wanted to make sure they weren't ammo. Yeah, there's like 10 of them in there though. That's pretty cool. Let's go a little deeper in here. Ew. This guy's got some interesting stuff so far, but somebody really could have helped him with this storage, you know? Just storing random food. Is that the lighter? Look. Another one brand new. That's kind of cool. What is this? This ammo? That's oh, great. You could have used that in your unit, buddy. Let's see over here. This right here? What's in here? Ugh, more batteries. 
This is just some random but cool stuff. There's at least these boxers are brand new. They're not used with questionable stains in it. Ooh, look. What do you think's in here? Where's it, where's it open? Where's it open? Oh, there it is. What in the heck is that? Uh, know, looks like it's missing know. a lighter. <laughs> I don't know. Let's see. PS5, what is this? This is a, repl a replacement power cord. I saw PS5. I mean, we've been finding stuff for the PS5 in here. It's bound to come eventually. Let's go down deeper. Deeper. That sounded bad. Uh, clean it. What is that? That is a... What? Flashlight. A flashlight. Okay. And this side, we're going to look over here too. Oh, look. Another one of our lighters. I don't even know how much those go for, but there's a bunch of them. What is this here though? Come here. Come here. This is another one of these. Look. Yeah. Okay. This guy, really random, but interesting so far. Other than that though, it looks like it's just kind of random junk thrown on top of a pillow. Let's mix it up and go to this bag here. Cause this is really hard stuff in here. It's not clothes or anything like that. So I'm kind of curious now. Who would have expected this unit to end up like this? Mm -hmm. Well, we got underwear, lovely. And then we got, what are these, just shoes? Looks like a pair of heels or something, a pair of flip flops. But look at this, this is brand new. Kind of random stuff in here, isn't it? Yeah. Like at first it was giving me like a country guy, and now it's looking like a younger girl. So it's like I'm kind of confused on who owned this unit. What is this right here? That is a shoe. Oh, the other one. Look how hard, like this was so hard. Mm -hmm. I thought it was something else. All that's in there is a few purses and a few shoes, and nothing's in anything. It's like these shoes and bags are new. Really random. While we're doing bags, let's see what's in this little one here. But first, make sure you leave this video a thumbs up and subscribe if you are new because we're always buying storage units. And this is how fun and random they can be. What is that? Just a little mouthwash or toothpaste? This? True. It's like beauty products or something. And there's a couple tampons. Okay. What about the rest of the bag? A pair of scissors. Like this. This looks ugly enough it could be designer. I always say that. Like designer stuff, so uh, never mind. Then it just look like one of those shirts that would say like Gucci on it or something. Yeah. And in here, nah, the rest of this is just clothes. Now let's bring the big box here out. Oh, it's heavy. I thought for sure these big boxes were gonna be clothes or shoes, but it doesn't feel like it. Oh, it's crazy I bought this unit because I thought there might be Nikes in it. And so far I haven't found any <laughs> Nikes or anything like that. Just nice gun stuff. Oh. I see boxes. No way. <laughs> is that a gaming headset? Look at all these. Oh my gosh. All these little boxes here. Okay, look. That's a PlayStation gaming headset, and that is new nice. in there. Quick eBay search shows that it's $23 pre owned, so probably about 25 to 30 brand new, like this one is. Brand new. What in the heck? Who would have ever thought? Size 13 Jordans? Yeah, That's baby. That's a shoe box. Oh, come on, come on, what is that? No way. These are used, but they're in really good shape. Like this stuff right here, this is just dust. This will take yep. two seconds with a wet paper towel. All I need is a magic eraser oh and gosh. make it look like new. That, I bet you that's more than the 90 we spent on the unit right there. Not quite the 90 we spent on the unit, but they're still selling for about $70 pre-owned and these are in excellent condition. That's insane. What about this? This is a turbo hotspot piece. And that's about $30 pre-owned on eBay. All right, that's cool. Well, let's go to some of these. What does that say? Charms. Char Charms? What are they? Oh, nice watch. That's sick, actually. That is really nice. <laughs> All right, let's set it aside. I can't believe this. This right here is a forcing watch company. Oh, it's wow. definitely in there. I can feel it. Oh, look at Ooh. that. This is crazy. Who would have ever thought a $90 unit with six boxes would end up like this. Not me. No. I just bought it because it was right here. Let's go again. Is this brand new cologne? Yeah, this is brand new cologne. $40 price tag on the bottom of that. And what are, this one's brand new as well. $40 price tag on the bottom of this one. This one right here. Oh, there goes the top. But unused again. This is all brand new cologne. I'll find the top later, but it's definitely it's right new. There. You see it? Oh, there it is. <laughs> Thank you. Now, is this one in there? Oh, yes, that feels right. You ready? Come on. Oh, they're a little more used, but I still guarantee you, give me like two minutes, three minutes at max, those things will be looking really fresh. These guys are about $100 pre-owned on eBay. Ha-ha. <laughs> they're just dirty. Shoe people, you know there's a difference between like a dirt stain that'll wipe off versus like actually screwed up. Those aren't screwed up. Look at this. Brand new cologne again. What is this one? Another watch? 
No, look at this. What the heck? This is wild to me. Who would have ever thought this? I feel like I've said that 10 times, but I'm sorry. I'm just in disbelief. Hollister cologne, brand new, more. Look, brand new cologne here. This one box is gonna pay for the entire unit multiple times over. But before we go to the next box, I need to tell you how to get your hands on this stuff. We're gonna be auctioning off pretty much everything in this unit starting at $1 over on our Whatnot, guys. The link is on the screen and also down in the description. If you never used Whatnot before, just think of it like eBay, except we're gonna be live with you the whole time and we're gonna be auctioning off all these items and they're all gonna be starting at a single dollar. If you use our link down there and you haven't signed up before, you get 15 free dollars and you could potentially get stuff for free just paying the shipping. All you have to do, create an account on the web and then download that app. Use the login you just created, then search for us and bookmark our upcoming show and you'll literally get that $15 for free. Maybe you'll get some $1 Jordans or $1 cologne, who knows. On to the next box. This is like another, these are pants of some sort. It looks like a uniform though, for sure. Yeah. Does this say law, what? Law Pro, is this a police uniform? Oh. Well, my man is a security guard. That explains all the ammunition. Where's the gun? It's gotta be in here somewhere. Right here, in the door dash bag. <laughs> Got your food, buddy. Click, clack. Let's see. Ooh, it stinks in here. What is this? These are, come here, out, you. Oh, more, more holsters. holsters. See, you thought I was joking when I said in the door dash bag. I'm only half joking. Let's see, what else is in there? No, no actual guns, but there are some more holsters, little necklace, very random stuff. All right, let's set this over here. What is this paper here for? Commonwealth of Virginia Department of Criminal Justice Services. Oh, this is, oh, this is, he completed his training to get his security firearm handgun permit. Why do you need one? You don't even need a permit to have the gun, but if you want to be security, you need a permit to have it. That makes a lot of sense. Let's go further in here. Towels, towels, towels. Oh, look what I see. A nice cool. Dell laptop. Does it have an operating system on it? It's an Inspiron 15. Don't be cracked, don't be cracked. Nice. Ooh, that is nice. That is nice. That's a, what does it say? It says i3. Ah, so it's not gonna be the best, but I guarantee it's still a nice laptop. Let's see if there's anything else hidden in here. This is a crazy little unit. This is a T-Mobile box right here. What's in there? Nothing. A little tablet box. Yeah. I'm guessing this one might have a tablet in it because it's heavier than that one. Let's see. Well, if it'll open, that's step one. Oh, no, it's just a heavier box. More Ooh. inserts. Well, towels, towels. Is this more cologne? Graphite cologne. $40 on that. Just in case I haven't said $40 in new to you yet. Oh, look, another watch too. There's another watch and I found one container I saw without a watch in it, so. It's probably this one. And if we go further over here, here's the one I was just talking about. It's an Armatron. Is this an Armatron? It doesn't, I don't know where I would say it at, but I'm just gonna set it there for now because it looks nice. Then further in here, yeah, I'm not seeing much else, but what a box. I'm still in just disbelief right now for $90. This is insane. Let's see what's in this little guy here. I'm gonna have to rip this one. That's knotted too tightly. Let's see. This is just a little tote bag, aluminum foil. Uh, what is this? Nice little tape gun. Hey, we need new ones, right? Yeah. You can always never have enough of those. They always break eventually. What else do we got in here? More pants. Over here. Ooh, jewelry box. Jewelry love, actually. Oh, cool. nothing. There's a Bluetooth speaker, it looks like, right here. And then, hey, what else is in here? Flashlight. A couple of remotes, maybe. There's a TV box right there inside, too. So maybe it's a remote to one of those. Nothing else in there that I'm seeing. If the magazines don't work, then we got this to get rid of the evidence <laughs> and lighters yeah and a bunch of lighters man <laughs> this dude is up to no good i'm telling you no i'm kidding let's see what was in here come here okay. oh all right this box has in it and this unit is only 90 dollars. 90 dollars, right crazy. like it's crazy i know let's see oh here you go oh yeah i've been waiting for this one i have i haven't found hangers in a long this. time okay there's a lot of hangers in there it's mostly junk but this uh, these are just a pair of glasses. Okay. okay, is that all that's in there? Other than this thing here, a box of tea. What about on this side? Let me check over here. Yeah, unfortunately, it's just bathroom mats and hangers. Let's get into the other big box. If this big box is anything like the last one, we're in for a good time. Let's see. Oh, I see a shirt. No, no clothes. 
uh, blankets. What is that? This is a uh, set of microfiber <laughs> pillowcases. Well, this right here, whatever Hi. these are, are brand new. Only 13 bucks, but they are brand new. What if we go deeper down in here? Sheets, blankets, no. Had to be one. Well, yeah, it had to be one. That's all that's in there, unfortunately. We got one of these nice foldable chairs. Big and tall, perfect for my big and tall self. <laughs> this little TV here, flat screen, no cracks or nothing. It's super Phillips. light, nice one. Now the question is, does this box have the TV in it? It feels like the weight is right, but it's obviously been resealed. So I don't know what's in there. It could be anything. This could be all the guns. Let's see. <laughs> could be. Oh, oh, TV box. Come on. Oh, I see the styrofoam. So I'm gonna go ahead and guess. Get that. Yeah, look right here. That's the TV. It's in there. It's in there. It's pretty much new or like new at least. It's been taken out and sealed, but hey, that's like a pretty good 43 inch screen. Let's do a recap. It's a lot of you guys are saying you missed those. This is a small unit. We can afford to do it really quick. First off, TV number one, plugged in, working perfect. Laptop right here. We did end up finding the charger for it and everything. It's got a password on it, but we'll remove that and it'll be up for auction for starting at a dollar too. <laughs> Then the big TV here, obviously we're not auctioning TV, you should be paying $200 to ship a $100 TV, so those will be sold locally. Now let's go over the small stuff, but let me put out a little disclaimer. You see the chair here? Let's just say there was a little something, something hidden inside that chair, a weapon, I'll, I'll get to that in a second. First, let's go to the side that's not going up for sale. This is our stuff that we're keeping. You can never have enough batteries, right? We can't be the only people that have a drawer stockpiled full of batteries from storage units because you never know when you're gonna use them. All the gun, firearm stuff, of course, you guys already know. We're keeping along with the ammo. I don't even know where that's at, but. Right there. Oh, right here. I didn't see it. <laughs> The ammo, the holsters, that kind of stuff. You already know that we're keeping those. Then if you come down here, PS5 headset, or perfect. A little AT&T hotspot, perfect. Four of these USB lighters. One of them still in the plastic, but I hit them all and they all still work. We got one, two, three, four, five watches, three of which are still in the box. And then one, two, three, four, five, six, seven things, a brand new cologne, all with $40 plus price tags on the bottom of them. None of them has been used one time. Can't beat that. Over here, two little pocket knives. Those are the ones that were stuck together. We got the little flashlight, which is like 25 bucks. These are the fragrances that were in that drawstring bag I was talking about. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11 of them, and they have $7.50 price tags on them. Probably just sell them as a big lot. Then over here, just like we said in the video, it took like 30 seconds with a wet paper towel and it took all the dirt right off these two pairs of Jordans. Again, they're gonna be starting at $1 for auction at the whatnot auction. And then what was hidden in the chair? I went to pull the chair out and something poked me. Look at this. Just casually inside the chair thing, a gigantic like ninja-like sword was just chilling in there. And I didn't even see it in the video until we went to go through it. But check that guy out right there. That is awesome. I really don't think you could do much better for a little $90 storage unit with six boxes than what we got here. It was definitely a jackpot. Don't forget to go to the link in the description, go to our whatnots, get ready for the auction, subscribe, like, and until next time, peace out.